So we were talking about the position of the ball relative to the feet and the body. The body is the powerhouse. When the ball is outside of the powerhouse, which is right here, you're going to lose power, you're going to top it, you're going to raise the ball, you're going to lose control. The powerhouse is the hips, the torso, and that's where you get your power from, not from your hands and your arms. So your hands are merely there to guide the stick and to apply the final bit of power to the ball. So let's go over the positions that we can hit the ball from. I could hit the ball here, and if I hit the ball here, it's going to go to the right. If I hit the ball here, the ball is going to go straight. Now I can move my foot here so the ball's outside. I can't, but I'm really turning my body so the ball is still between my feet and I can hit the ball on a diagonal behind me. And you normally you'd curve in just with one or two steps, change your angle of attack, and hit it that way. I can also hit the ball off my right foot. And again, I've got the triangle between my shoulders and my hands. I'm going to come down. I'm going to have an abbreviated follow through. I don't want to follow through too far on the right side because I'll open my shoulders up. I want to keep my shoulders in line with the target. Now, keeping your shoulders in line with the target always is going to telegraph the direction of the hit. You don't want to telegraph the direction of the hit. So, you need to learn to roll your wrists slightly on the downswing, which is a very advanced skill.